Hey, good morning, everybody. Uh, I'm over here at the Chicago, at, uh, Chicago Cook County Forest Preserve, and I'm just got done with a four mile run with Bam Bam. The kind of he's four years old, so we kind of did a little anniversary run, and uh, I needed to jump start my cardio anyway. So four miles would be good. Ouch! He's whining, so I had to give him a blast there. Anyways, uh, while I was running, it's kind of interesting. Um, I don't want to sound like a bragger because I'm not bragging. Uh, you could train, and I have trained, with the best in the world. Uh, Guru Dan Asano, Sensei Eric Paulson, uh, Sifu Larry Hartzell, uh, Crew Richard Abraham, Sifu Fong, uh, the list goes on. And I'm very proud and humble that they've allowed me to work with them throughout the years. But the bottom line is this. Regardless of how many times you go and you train with somebody who is considered the best, you think they're the best, whatever the case may be, and whatever information they give you, you need to apply it. You need to do the work. You need to train. And then you'll be good. Then it'll be worth it for you to take that time, take that effort, do those drills, and do them over and over again. Because if you don't put the time in, you need to be the best for yourself. If you don't put the time in, it doesn't matter who you work with. You're just getting information. You're storing it up, which is nice, but you yourself aren't growing. You need to do that on your own. And they can guide you and help you, but you're the bottom line. You need to get it done and put the time in. Just like with Bam Bam, uh, I've gotten him the best trainers in the world. Right now, Jim Morgan, Chicago Canine Academy. As far as I'm concerned, he's the best. And I put the time in with Bam Bam outside of his classes to get him to where I need him to be. Uh, he would complain about him whining right now. Sorry, Jim. But anyways, uh, you need to do the work. You put the time in, put the work in, you will get the results. And then all the stuff that you learn from these guys who are the best will just make it that much sweeter. And then the bottom line also, I know I keep saying bottom line because that's what it is. It's all up to you. You're the one that has to make it happen. Then after you make it happen, you're going to have some days where mm, you don't feel like doing it, but you push yourself. You know, just get in the gym, go for a run, go for a walk, do whatever you got to do, hit the heavy bag, call a buddy up to help you. Ouse! He wants to go play in the park. And uh, just do what you got to do. You know, jam the stones, jam the who, put some Zeppelin on, whatever the case may be, and uh, put the headphones on and just go, you know, and do it. That's bottom line. Without sounding like a cliche, the old Nike thing, just do it. That's the truth. One foot in front of the other, uh, like in uh, Creed, you know, one round at a time, that type of thing. Okay? All right, everybody, have a good day, and I'll check back in with you soon. Bam, bam, say bye. That's a good buddy. Say bye. No, he don't want to. He's mad. Okay, take care, everybody.